Are you loving TV's best new sci-fi thriller devs, but secretly hoping the spooky tech isn't possible in real life? Well, guess what? It kind of is. It's more complex, more nuanced, but still. On this spoiler-filled IMD brief, we're exploring how much of the bonkers science and tech in devs is science fact or science fiction. Devs is a mind-bending new miniseries on FX from Ex Machina and Annihilation mastermind Alex Garland. It follows Lily Chan, a software engineer at fictional tech company Amaya, as she investigates both the death of her boyfriend and Amaya's super-secret development division, aka Devs. What am I actually doing here? I'm not gonna tell you. Okay, fine, we'll tell you. The Devs team is working on a quantum computer that can look backward and forward in time with alarming precision. Are you ready? Um... No. First and foremost, quantum computers are not science fiction at all. They're computers that use quantum mechanics to massively increase processing power, and they really do look like weird steampunk sculptures. It's the most beautiful thing I've ever seen. They're so fast that in October of 2019, Google's quantum computer completed a task in 200 seconds that would have taken the world's most powerful supercomputer 10,000 years to complete. It was a f miracle! Actually, it was science. While real quantum computers can't look into the future or past like they do on devs, they have been able to reverse time for a tiny particle, but so far, nothing larger. So, right in front of my eyes, you just predicted the exact behavior of a living organism. Okay, so the computer itself might be possible someday, but what about the crazy, floating, completely sealed vacuum it's housed in? This entire structure is supported by electromagnetic fields. Unfortunately, it's not possible to use magnetic levitation, or maglev for my portmanteau fans out there, at this scale yet. However, maglev high-speed trains do exist, and an architect in Dubai is working on prototypes for floating buildings as we speak. Is it madness? Is there a world in which it could work? Last but certainly not least, Devs is digging deep into a favorite sci-fi trope, the multiverse. And just so we're all clear what that means, it means the universe is constantly splitting, like the trunk and branches and twigs of an infinitely large tree. And on that tree, all possible worlds will exist. It's been used in everything from Spider-Man into the Spider-Verse to the Man in the High Castle to sliding doors. For now, the multiverse theory is still just a theory. However, instead of operating in binary bits like regular old computers, quantum computers are so fast because they're able to hold multiple values at the same time. Some theorize that these computers could be the key to unlocking multiple worlds, too. I'm from another dimension. I mean, another, another dimension. If you want to dive into quantum physics and the multiverse even more, check out PBS Digital Studios series Space Time. Alex Garland even used the show for research while writing devs. That's impressive. And make sure to add all these great titles to your watch list. For more trending stories, stay glued to imdb.com slash imdbrief.